Do you ever feel overwhelmed by the ever-changing world of technology? Tech It Out can help make some sense of it all. Breaking down geek speak into street speak, technology columnist, author, and TV personality Mark Saltzman covers consumer technology each week for every listener. Mark tackles the latest news, reviews, and how-tos to help you understand what's hot, what's not, and why. Hey, everyone. Welcome to Tech It Out, episode 123. That's right. It's episode 123. We've been doing this show and podcast since July of 2017. So thank you for tuning in and thank you to Asus, the title sponsor on this program, for your continued support. In fact, we'll chat with Asus in a moment about its stellar laptops for the holidays. We have a great Tech It Out show planned for you this hour with five different segments and four guests. So instead of some small talk off the top of the show, let's go ahead and kick things off. Tis the season to treat yourself to a new laptop, or perhaps pick one up for the kids or your parents, to take advantage of great deals over Black Friday and Cyber Monday. But how do you know what to pick up? There are so many different brands to consider, and screen sizes, operating systems, and specs to read. It can be overwhelming to know what to invest in. Well, the laptop that I use for work and play is an Asus ZenBook. Joining us on the line to chat all about Asus and its laptops, we've got Philip Shung. He is the Assistant Product Manager at Asus North America. Hi, Philip. Welcome to the show and happy holidays. Happy holidays to you too. Thank you. So before we talk about shopping for a specific laptop for, for you or your family, tell us about Asus. Sure. Asus is an IT hardware company celebrating its 30th anniversary this year. We started out producing motherboards and have since branched out into laptops, desktops, phones, routers, and all sorts of other product lines. To date, Asus has shipped over 500 million motherboards, enough to wrap around the world four times if we place them end-to-end. On the consumer PC side, we are still worldwide number three, and if we're only counting in the Asia-Pacific sectors, we are actually number one overall. Oh, wow. In 2006, Asus launched our own unique sub uh, gaming brand called the Republic of Gamers. Just recently, it celebrated its 10th year anniversary and ROG, Republic of Gamers for short, continues to be on the cutting edge of technology where we're continuing the proud Asus tradition of innovation and the search for incredible. And we will get to some of that hardware in our chat if we have time, but not including gaming laptops to start. If I'm not mistaken, there are three kinds of laptops that Asus has. There's the ZenBook, the VivoBook, and then there's Chromebooks. Can you tell us about the three categories? Sure, be more than happy to. So ZenBooks. ZenBooks are our premium, stylish ultrabooks that are kind of have an emphasis for the productivity. The reason why is because it's kind of invented, intended for the young professionals where, or, you know, businessmen that are frequently traveling. They need a light and, you know, mobile solution, but it doesn't sacrifice power either. So our ZenBooks come with kind of the latest and greatest in Intel CPUs, either the i5 or the i7 packages. Right. Also comes with a lot of uh, capable RAM, up to 16 gigabytes of RAM and can contain up to one terabyte um, SSD to make sure you have, you know, the most bang for your buck while still um, on the go and so on and so forth. It comes with a respectable uh, a graphics card, either a GTX 1650 or an MX250. Let's move and switch gears a little bit over to the Vivo books. So whereas Zen books was more of the premium, the stylish, Vivo books is more for expressive, more creative. You want to be yourself, be you, be unique, all right? One of the very cool things we have about Vivo books is we have a plentiful of color options, right? Instead of the normal kind of boring blue or black, we have like white pink or maybe even green. Some of the options may include, you know, like a very vibrant blue. That's a normal kind of office space kind of notebooks, right? So the Vivo books are very much intended for kind of college age students, other young professionals, maybe even artists, right? So it's a great blend of both performance, but also being that very unique, awesome appearance look, all right? Still comes with a very capable i5 and i7 C, uh, CPU, still, you know, the same similar graphics as our Zen books, kind of in the 8 to 16 gigabyte RAM area, and still can come up with, you know, up to one terabyte of SSD, depending on what model you are looking at. Okay, so both the Zen books and the Vivo books run Windows as the OS, as the operating system, but Asus also has a Chromebook family. Exactly, yes. Chromebooks are now becoming more and more of a familiar uh, site inside classrooms for young students because it has an excellent battery life. And it's also very ruggedized. What that means is it can stand up to a lot of punishment. If you accidentally dropped it, no worries. If you spilled coffee on it or maybe even a juice can on it, 
No worries. You pick it up back up, wipe it right off. Chromebook works just as normal. Okay, it's very um, capable for young students. You know, it has the Chrome OS loaded inside of it, so it's you know for easy browsing. You can access also to the cloud for additional storage, but at the same time providing a very family-friendly solution with you know, a variety of parental controls to make sure that young children who have access to it don't you know browse in areas that the parents don't want them to. Also, it comes it, since it is a Chromebook, it is fully compatible with the Google Play Store, so any app Apps that want to be downloaded with mom and dad's permission, of course, are fully compatible with a Chromebook. Okay, so that was a good look at the three different main categories that Asus has, not including the Republic of Gamers or ROG brand. But when it comes to shopping for a laptop, whether it is a ZenBook, VivoBook, or Chromebook, what are some of the latest features people want for work and play? Like, where do you start? Do you talk form factor, whether you decide if it's laptop or desktop? And then once you decide on a laptop, do you decide if you want something super thin and light or something with more power under the hood, which is often a little bit thicker? How do you approach that question when someone Someone asks you what to look for. Well, Mark, that's actually a great question. But typically what our users have uh, provided feedback on is they're really looking for the lighter and the thinner product. So kind of gone are the days where people are lugging kind of thicker, you know, bricks, you know, where it's, you know, five, seven, eight pounds. Users are increasingly looking for kind of the lighter, the thin, so like less than two centimeters thin. We're talking like two or three pounds light. So something that can easily fit into a bag, you know, for the on-the-go solution. But you also hit on a great point there when it comes down to power. You know, users are still looking for, you know, something that has, you know, that, you know, the i5 or the i7 or for for those who are looking more for the AMD options, an R5 or an R7 with a smat, with a good uh, you know mix of RAM and SSD, so it's kind of best of both worlds thing. But definitely thin and light is you know much more in demand. In fact, one other thing that users have been more and more asking for is the ability to do more multitasking. You know, especially nowadays, you know, where with social media, maybe you're dancing back and forth between Twitter, Facebook, but you're still answering emails on that. Board. So one screen simply isn't enough. A lot of users are saying, hey, I need a secondary monitor. Right? So the, in the past, the most common solution was, well, I'm going to buy a second monitor and hook it up to my laptop. So one really cool uh, tech, an innovation feature that Asus introduced this year is the screen pack technology. So in place of the normal touchpad, the screen pad serves both the touchpad, but is also fully functional as a secondary screen. So if maybe you want to you know, listen to a bit of music on Spotify, watch a video either on YouTube or Netflix, guess what? That screen pad has got you covered. So while you're plugging away on the main screen, typing away you know, on your emails, you can still enjoy that extra bit of music and watch that clip down on near the touchpad area and then basically you're able to do, kind of have a best of both worlds. Awesome. Yeah, I think the uh, screen pad is such a cool innovation for sure. We're chatting with Philip Shung, Assistant Product Manager at Asus North America. With Black Friday and Cyber Monday on the horizon, is this a good time to buy a laptop? I mean, are Asus's gear usually on sale around this time? To answer that question, yes. This year, even before Black Friday and Cyber Monday, it's actually a great time to be buying a laptop. The reason why is that compared to pre years prior, the new deals that are being made available this year are hitting the calendar year at even earlier. So like retailers such as Amazon, Best Buy, Costco, they're already having some very impressive deals made available. And yes, it is a possibility that Cyber Monday or Black Friday has an even better deal, but you'd be missing out right now if you're not picking up on some of these really cool deals. And what makes the deal even sweeter is that a lot of these retailers have a great return policy. Say you bought a product off of Amazon today and then in, in a week and a half, Amazon has an even better deal out. You might say, you know what? I like that new deal even better. I'm going to go ahead and buy that one. I can return the one I bought a week and a half ago at no cost. So yes, right now is a great time to be starting to pick up and check out some of those awesome new deals that are available right now. And what are some of the latest models from Asus that you're particularly excited about? When it comes to the latest models that I'm excited about, nothing excites me more than the ZenBook Pro Duo. So I was talking earlier about the screen pad and the ability to have a secondary screen. What happens is if I told you the ZenBook Pro Duo comes with that awesome screen pad technology, but it's 14 inches across. It's so large that it takes up half of the bottom portion of your, your screen. And on top of that, the ZenBook Pro, Pro Duo is kind of the best of both worlds. It packs some serious specs at, with an i7 or a 99, 32 gigabytes of RAM, one terabyte of SSD, a great top of the line graphics card. So basically, you can do your work and game on this one device. 
So it is indeed the most cool device I have currently right, right now, and I'm super excited for it. Yeah, I remember when this debuted at Computex, everybody online was freaking out at how radical the design was. But it's not a gimmick. It's got a lot of practical applications. Indeed, it does. Some of the things that's very good for beyond the multitasking piece I was talking about earlier is that it opens up so many more opportunities for the users to explore. For example, maybe you're streaming like a video or a game. You could be gaming away on the primary monitor, and that secondary screen has so much room for you to interact with maybe you know your Twitch channel, you know your your Discord. As we wrap up, Philip, is there a website where we can see all of these laptops, whether they be ZenBooks, VivoBooks, Chromebooks, or ROG? What would be the best site? Asus.com? Indeed it is, yes. For more information, please visit our website at www.asus.com. We contain a wealth of information there, not only for our products and various notebooks, but also you can get a sneak peek at what's coming around the corner in terms of the latest technology. We even have a behind-the-scenes look that showcases collaboration between Asus and some of the local artists and creators. Okay, Philip Shunk, thank you very much for your time. Wishing you a happy holiday season. Thanks again. Thank you for having me. And once again, thank you to Asus for your continued support on this program. We'll tell you more about the company a little bit later on in this show and some other products that they've got. But you're listening to Tech It Out on the Radio America Network. When we return, I'll share a few Black Friday related deals that I like, some gear and games. So hang tight. We'll be right back. Listen to Tech It Out whenever you want. Find the Tech It Out podcast at iTunes or wherever you get your podcasts. Welcome back to Tech It Out. So I wanted to spend a couple of minutes talking about some really cool gadgets and other gear that I showed on TV last week as part of a Black Friday series of interviews. I was on several shows talking about how to score a good deal at the same time recommending some tech too. So without further ado, I started off with the Nintendo Switch Lite. As you likely know, the Nintendo Switch is the wildly popular game system from Nintendo, but they've expanded the family to include the Switch Lite. As the name suggests, this is a very light and compact gaming system. It is really a dedicated handheld device. So the controllers are built now into the system itself. So you can play on the go, on the bus, in the back of a car, when you're back at home with your feet up on the coffee table, have a lot of fun with the Nintendo Switch Lite. Of course, it works with all the games that you know and love, the likes of the Mario games and Zelda. And then last week, Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield debuted, a pair of new role-playing games that have done really well in the sales department. Uh, really fun games. And this is also playable on the Nintendo Switch Lite. The Nintendo Switch Lite costs $199. Next up, I showed the Sony in-ear truly wireless headphones. These are available at Best Buy stores and bestbuy.ca. These are really small and cool looking, truly wireless earbuds as the name suggests. As you likely know, many smartphones today don't have a headphone jack anymore, but even if yours does, you like the convenience of being untethered to your smartphone while you're working out or walking around town. It has phenomenal noise cancelling, so these uh, Sony earbuds work with Android or iPhone, and it has active noise cancelling. So not only does it block out ambient noise passively when you put the earbud in your ear, which is very comfortable, by the way, but it introduces an electronic, let's call it anti-noise, to cancel out the sound that it hears around you through its microphones. So it uh, really makes it sound super quiet if you don't play any music at all. And if you do, there's really nothing between you and your tunes or your podcast, your audiobooks, or your phone calls. Calls. It does have, of course, microphones so the person you're chatting with can hear you, uh, but it's got four and a half hours of battery life with the active noise cancellation or ANC turned on or up to 24 hours with the charging case that it comes with. It also has Google Assistant built in with uh, touch controls. So you can ask a question, summoning your favorite personal assistant and uh, a lot more. So these again are from Best Buy. There's two different colors, black and silver, and it costs $229. All right. Next up is Uma Tello 4G. You probably know Uma, the award-winning phone service that uses VoIP or voice over internet protocol. But now they've got a 4G cellular option here. It's an adapter for connecting the internet through a wireless 4G LTE connection provided by Sprint. It's only about 20 bucks a month, which is great. And Uma Tello 4G also includes E911. So connecting callers directly to their local first responders during an emergency, heaven forbid, but it could happen. But unlike mobile phones, which often connects to a regional or even a national call 
call center and can't automatically share the caller's street address, this UMA solution can. So it's a great uh, safe alternative to using your mobile device. Again, this is a great service that sounds great. There's a range of features you can learn about at UMA.com. The phone service is available for $129. And then again, for an extra 20 bucks or so a month, you can have that 4G option, which is about half the cost of traditional landlines. Again, that's UMA.com. Second last item is a gorgeous TV from Samsung called the Serif 4K Smart TV. Whenever I showed this on TV, the crew was always asking questions about it. It was absolutely gorgeous. So the TV has got a very unique look. It's got that Serif, that sort of curved font style, if you will, on the sides of the TV. So it's got this like iconic eye-shaped profile, which makes it look great wherever you put it in the room. It's got a metal stand that it comes with. So aside from style, which I do think is like the, the biggest hallmark of this uh, uh, TV. It kind of harkens back to the days when a TV was a piece of furniture that you were proud to have in your home and it was a conversation piece. But aside from that, it is a QLED TV, of course, quantum dot technology with 100% of the color volume that you want for very vibrant colors as well as great brightness and contrast and a wide viewing angle. It's got that ambient mode. So when you're not watching TV, instead of a black rectangle on the stand or on a fireplace mantle, you can have high resolution artwork on it. So it looks like a picture frame or other information that you choose. I also love the NFC built in or near field communications. You can actually place your smartphone on top of the TV and it'll start playing the music from your phone through your TV speakers. And then finally, it is a smart TV, of course. So you got access to all your favorite streaming music services. So that's the Serif 4K smart TV, which usually sells for $15.99 for the 55 inch model, but it will be on sale for a few hundred dollars off on Black Friday, all the way up to December. December 12th. Finally, what do you give as a gift to the person who has everything? I love the Ancestry DNA Kit. If you haven't done this already, it's an at-home DNA kit. Uh, You know, a recent survey found that 62% of Canadians want to give a more meaningful gift, and I would argue this is. Ancestry DNA asks for a small saliva sample, and you send it off, and then you get personalized ethnicity estimates from more than a 1,000 regions around the world. You see it on a map going back hundreds of years, so you can see where your family is from and any migration patterns. You've got access to more than 15 million people in the database. So it cross-references your DNA and gives you really accurate results. You can find long lost relatives. You can build a family tree if you like, get in touch with cousins. It's really pretty wild stuff. It's the Ancestry DNA kit that I did a couple of years ago and information is still being updated. I still get more information sent to me through the uh, through email. Then I check it out on the app and website. Usually Ancestry DNA is not $99, but leading up to and over Black Friday, it's $59. So 40 bucks off. Who doesn't like that? Well, there you have it. A look at some great gadgets and gear and a little bit of science thrown in for good measure leading up to Black Friday. Speaking of gear, this program is brought to you in part by Western Digital and its super rugged G technology branded Armor ATD portable hard drive. It's designed for those looking for a durable drive to bring on the go, especially for content creators like photographers, YouTubers, and Instagrammers. Head over to g-technology.com for more. We'll be right back with more tech it out want to follow mark google it mark with a c and saltzman with a z breaking down geek speak into street speak this is tech it out tech it out with technology columnist author and tv personality mark saltzman Welcome back to Tech It Out, powered by Asus, the company that creates technology for today and tomorrow's smart life, including its line of award-winning laptops, desktops, smartphones, tablets, smartwatches, and more. For those in search of incredible, visit asus.com slash us slash radio for more info. That's asus.com forward slash us forward slash radio. It's been a few months since we've had one of my favorite display companies on the show, ViewSonic, a company mostly known for its many computer monitors, but they've also got projectors and professional digital displays and more. To hear what's new and newsworthy from ViewSonic for both consumers and businesses, we're joined by Jeff Volpe. He's the president of ViewSonic for the Americas. Welcome back to the show, Jeff, and happy holidays to you. Oh, thanks, Mark. Happy holidays to you as well. Good to be back. Now, before we talk about specific products, please tell us something most people should already know about ViewSonic and maybe something people might not know. 
Sure, yeah. USONIC Corporation is a global company, and uh, we've been in operations for over 35 years. Uh, we have a uh, full, broad line of displays. In fact, probably the largest display lineup across all categories of any other manufacturer, which includes desktop solutions. We have over 100 different monitors for desktop solutions. We have a number of projectors which cover the home theater as well as large venue and office and conference room and classrooms. Plus, we have a full line of large screens for conference rooms and classrooms, both touch and non-touch. And in addition, we have our own software for the collaboration suite of productivity tools for conference rooms, meetings, and education called myviewboard.com. Our headquarters are in California. We've won over 2,000 awards for our innovation and our quality. And uh, we have all of our engineering and software development um, in, uh, in Taipei with our headquarters here in California. Awesome. That was a good cross-section of the kinds of products that ViewSonic makes. But let's chat computer gaming. It's super hot, of course. Tell us about the XG-branded ViewSonic monitors and what makes them stand out. In fact, Jeff, I showed on TV today the XG2702, which got a really great response. Oh, that's great. Our, uh, that's a very popular uh, one of uh, our, our XG products. The size, the fast response, the resolution, the contrast and vivid colors all make that product a really, really popular one. It's also very value priced for the competitive gamer. But, you know, to expand on that, our XG and our Elite products are designed for the gamers. The, we, we built in the right sizes, resolution, uh, we have a number of different um, uh, elements there that we specifically cater to the gamer, and the fast response time is one of the keys, so that uh, whether you're in a first-person shooter game or uh, a fast-paced game, you get excellent um, visual. The focus is all the time uh, 100% so that you have a chance to see your, your uh, combatants or your competitors. Um, they're very stylish. The design for the gaming environment, uh, lots of fun. Uh, we also have a number of our XG products that have RGB lighting, which matches to keyboards and mice and some of their computers that are enabled with LCD, LED uh, lighting. So it's, it's really fitting into that gaming environment for style and performance. And um, they also built in the ViewSonic quality so that you can run these things for hours and hours without worrying about them breaking down or um, giving you difficulty while you're in your gaming uh, environments. And they're backed by ViewSonic's uh, ex excellent industry-standing three-year warranty. Really positions them to the higher end of the gaming space for, um, for those really gaming enthusiasts across all of Canada and the U.S. And, you know, it's also great. It's for work and for play, I'd argue, as well. In fact, today I demonstrated how versatile the monitor, being able to adjust it in many different ways and even turn it uh, vertically for a portrait uh, mode instead of landscape uh, just by twisting it around and uh, how easy it was. So you can work on it for spreadsheets and for Word documents and web browsing and all that. And then, you know, maybe on your downtime, you've got uh, a great monitor that can keep up with the latest games with things like AMD's uh, FreeSync and one millisecond response times and all that. Indeed. We're chatting with Jeff Volpe, president of ViewSonic for the Americas. Now, as we've touched on earlier, Jeff, ViewSonic also makes some compelling projectors. I love the M1 Plus. Tell us about that one in particular. Sure. The M1 Plus is uh, our second generation of this portable product. It's about the, it's about the size of a thick paperback book. It's nice and small. It weighs only two pounds. It uh, has a built-in battery. It's autofocus. It's LED technology, which allows you to have a really long running life without having any worry about having to change a bulb like the old style of projectors. It has some really great features that helps this product be very versatile for both consumers and for businesses. For the businesses, it's a wonderful product to be able to take a projector with you and do any kind of conference or meeting room where you want people to look around and see a bigger image. But for those consumers out there, it's, it's a really fun product that you can take with you, uh, backyard videos, um, you can do a number of things, maybe it's camping or who knows what it is, but you have this portability that allows you to do a, a number of things. It has built-in memory, plus it has a micro SD to allow you to expand that memory so you can actually store 
video or store content, whether it be for coaching purposes or teaching purposes or entertainment purposes, you can store data onto those that built-in memory. I think my favorite thing about this product, however, though, is it has smart Wi-Fi, which is one of the most significant changes that we did this year versus last year, and that allows you to stream content till your heart's content. You can even download some fun apps that you might like to do, like YouTube or other apps that allow streaming services and binge till your heart's content. Really, really a unique capability. And then, of course, you can direct connect your devices. Fun product, a very convenient small package for people to enjoy content, teach content, do sales calls. Um, and, geez, it's, it's a really good price as well for a holiday. It's a perfect uh, perfect gift and stocking stuffer. Mm-hmm. And, again, I love the built-in uh, Harman Kardon speakers, the uh, fact that it turns on immediately once you reveal the lens cover, which is, it doubles as a stand. Yes. Uh, there's a lot to love about it. So it's the M1 Plus. Where could our listeners go to learn more about the M1 Plus, your XG and Elite gaming monitors, and everything else that ViewSonic has to offer? Well, I'm very happy to say that all of our products um, are going to be available at popular e-commerce locations around uh, North America. We also uh, have a lot of details on our website, viewsonic.com. And uh, we're also with you working on this great contest with uh, Tech the Halls, where we're uh, we're offering some contests and promotions for people to participate in. They can go to viewsonic.com slash tech the halls and get lots of information on how to participate in that contest and possibly win themselves something for Christmas holidays. Well, thank you, Jeff, for your time and your expertise and for the partnership on that great contest. I will tell our listeners more about that. We've been chatting with Jeff Volpe, president of ViewSonic for the Americas. All the best for a happy and healthy holiday season. Thanks, Jeff. Mark, thank you very much, and the same to you and yours. We'll be right back with more Tech It Out. Stay with us. Breaking down geek speak into street speak. Tech It Out, hosted by Mark Saltzman. Welcome back to Tech It Out, everyone. Can you believe it? Holiday shopping is already underway. Well, that year went fast, no? But how do you know what everyone wants? Well, probably it's tech-related. And joining us to tell us what's hot, we've got on the line tech expert Katie Linendahl to share some trending tech for the holiday season. Hi, Katie. Welcome back to the show. Ah, thank you for having me back. It's, it's exciting because it's the holidays. And as we know, Q3, Q4, just jam-packed with awesome gadgets. Mm-hmm. Indeed. Uh, it's something I cover all year round, but I think 40% of all purchases are in November and December. So that does make a lot of sense. And I know laptops, computers are, are a popular yeah. gift this time of year. What do you recommend? Yeah, totally. So I had a chance to partner with some amazing brands. And let's just start off with an industry favorite, which is the Dell XPS 13 in one which is completely versatile and was a great idea, born out of listening to customers and innovating every last detail top to bottom. And we talk about the versatility. I think it's important, you know, no matter how you work or how you play, laptop mode, tablet mode, got you covered. Also, compact in size and something that it's known for. It's the stunning virtual borderless edge-to-edge display, which Mm -hmm. makes a huge difference. And then, you know, you and I love this, powered by the latest Intel processor, so you got speed, power, and efficiency. And throw that baby right in your bag, long battery life. The Dell XPS 13 2-in-1 is in its amazing price point, but also just myself included, the reviews just through the moon into being an industry favorite. Yeah, I love the Infinity display, virtually edge-to-edge glass, and uh, it's got a lot of performance as well. So if you're into gaming, it's also a, a great uh, device. How much does that Dell XPS 13 2-in-1 cost? The 2 in is about twelve ninety nine. dollars The XPS itself starts at nine ninety nine. Right. So if you don't need like the kind of the versatility, you can also go in that route. Right, got it. And of course, a 2-in-1 is when you can bend back the screen on its 360-degree yeah. hinge and then use it like a tablet. All right. What about something for the kids? Oh, I'm a huge, proud aunt, so I'm always on the hunt for the latest cool tech toys. And I always like to see what holiday season we have because it's gotten come a long way since when – maybe I don't want to – I'm dating myself. I don't know about you, but since when I was little. But <laughs> from too. VTech, uh, there's Myla the Magical Unicorn. And you might start seeing this pop up and all those gift guides you get sent to the house. And rightfully so because it is really cool. It's this unicorn that is an interactive – friend, if you will, that glitters and she talks and sings and she has all these lights. And she also comes with this magical brush that allows you to add color to her eyes, to her horn and her wings. And she has a microphone as well. So she'll even sing a duet. 
And I got to tell you, I have a five-year-old niece, and this is just like right up her alley. Mm -hmm. Made for ages four plus, under 60 bucks. And again, from VTech, my love of magical unicorn. And just so fun. I mean, even the technology just baked inside here. I, you know, you open these up and you're like, oh, I can't believe that this is this works the way it does. It's, it's pretty awesome. Yeah, they're a great company, VTech. And then they also acquired mm-hmm. LeapFrog, which is another uh, popular mm-hmm. kids brand. So they're, they're really on a roll. We're chatting with tech expert Katie Linendahl, who joins us on this program every couple of months to tell us what's hot. With holidays around the corner, any other recommendations? Yes, uh, for me, headphones are always a go-to gift. And I want to introduce you to Aftershocks Aeropex. And I know you're probably familiar with Aftershocks. Mm-hmm. Uh, the latest Aeropex are great for the commuter and great for the runner. I am a huge runner, and you got to keep safety top of mind. And what makes these so different is they use bone conduction technology. So basically, your ears are never covered, ensuring that you're completely aware and also comfortable in all environments. So yes, you hear your surroundings and stay alert. Love that. And I like them also, too, because they're wraparound, obviously Bluetooth, no wires, waterproof, weigh less than an ounce, eight-hour battery life. And I wasn't surprised. You know, I've been running with them in New York City and also in Boston, and I am... I get why runners are their biggest audience. I mean, you've got to keep safety top of our mind and hear your surroundings when you're on the road. And under 160 bucks, great gifting option and a great go-to durable pair of headphones for the runner or the commuter. Aftershocks, of course, is with a Z at the end, Aftershocks. Yes. And I understand you've got a recommendation for something in the home as well. Yeah, i got a home option for you from KitchenAid. KitchenAid has a seven-cup, very durable food processor. And I think this is ideal for, you know, we have those home chefs in our lives that are getting ready to make the holiday dishes. And what's unique about this is it's easy to clean, it's easy to use, and it's easy to store. And probably the first thing that you notice is it has a one-click bowl with a latched lid, so you're not twisting and jamming things on once you get you going and making the dishes. But also, as you can guess, it has easy access to chop, puree, shred, slice, everything from cucumbers to cheese, again, making holiday prep. And probably the biggest bonus is easy to clean. The bowl and the lid and the accessories of the seven cup food processor are dishwasher safe. So I think that's a huge bonus. Nothing worse than having to clean around all those blades. You just throw it in the dishwasher under a hundred bucks. Great option from KitchenAid. Awesome. And then what about gamers? I, I know Aftershocks also mm. makes headphones for gamers, but I think you have another suggestion too. Yes, I am a huge Nintendo gamer. That's my vertical. And <laughs> let's talk GameStop because that's somewhere you, you can often find me. Um, GameStop obviously offers the new Switch Lite, which was released not too long ago, and it is all about portability for the gamer on the go at a great price of just $199. And I am playing Luigi's Mansion 3 and other exciting releases. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield just came out. And I have already gifted a Switch Lite myself, probably more to come. But uh, great to go ahead into GameStop and great gift for any gamer on the go. And have to also hit you with a URL because GameStop.com slash gift ideas this holiday season is just hooking you up with awesome, unique options. <laughs> and I'm also playing Luigi's Mansion 3 on my Switch. Yes! I was just on an airplane last night playing that game. So, yeah, I'm with you on oh, that. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. The graphics, are, I, I never get all sick of the graphics. Like, I, this is to me like the new Odyssey. I don't know about you. Super Mario Odyssey, great game as well. I'm, I'm impressed that you're a Nintendo fangirl. Love it. Oh, big time, big time. I actually I did an interview one time with Shigeru Miyamoto. So Awesome. All right, then finally, Katie, what's the best website to learn more about these products or even to see them in action, like with video? Absolutely. You can head on over to techgifts.tv to check out all these products. And yeah, you're right, with some video as well. All right, techgifts.tv, tech expert Katie Linendahl. Happy holidays to you. Thank you for your time. Happy holidays. Thank you. When we return on Tech It Out, we're going to catch up with this awesome company and app called Flip. That's F-L-I-P-P, designed to save you money. We'll be right back. Follow Mark Saltzman on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram. Listen to Tech It Out whenever you want. Shoppers, why spend more money than you need to? Well, overspending is a thing of the past with apps like Flip, one of my all-time favorite apps, in fact. It takes all those circulars, those flyers, those weekly store ads that we get in the mail and puts it all into one place for you on your phone or tablet or on a web browser, but it shows you the best deals near you. And that's just the beginning. Joining us to chat is Christina McNally, Flip's Chief Deals Officer, or CDO for short. Hi, Christina. Thanks for your time. Hi, Mark. Thanks for chatting with us. 
I know this is a busy time of the year for you, especially. Now, I use Flip all year round, but especially leading up to Black Friday. Tell us what Flip is all about. Absolutely. So Flip is a must-have savings tool for shoppers by simply downloading the free app and inputting either your zip code or your postal code. You're connected with thousands of deals, sales, and flyers from all of your favorite local and national retailers. Okay, awesome. So I know depending on where you live, it's it's called weekly ads or circulars or flyers as you called it, which is the, the word that I grew up using. And this is these are the paper ads that we get in the mail every week for all your local stores, be it for supermarkets and other grocery stores, as well as like department stores and consumer electronics, big box retailers. What Flip does is that you aggregate all of those amazing ads, but you don't, you don't just stop there. You also show the best deals near you and even coupons that you can use for even a further deal, right? We do. So for our U.S. shoppers, we have coupons on the app for a lot of your local stores that provide loyalty programs. So if you're thinking your CBSs or your Publix, any store that has a loyalty program, we try to bring in as many of those coupons as possible. And in Canada, you also support loyalty cards. So with me, my Flip app has all of my loyalty cards there, all the plastic cards that are in a drawer somewhere at home. Absolutely. So for our Canadian shoppers, a lot of us have loyalty cards to our favorite stores instead of having to carry that plastic around with us everywhere we go or remembering to have it with us when we're in the store. You can put those loyalty cards right into your Flip app so that you can pull them up really easily. All right. So walk us through the process. You download this free app. It's Flip with two P's, F-L-I-P-P. You can download it from the App Store for iPhone and iPad or the Google Play Store for Android devices. And then you type in your zip code or your post postal code and it'll show you your local deal. So we're talking retail deals that are near you, right? So absolutely. It brings in all of your favorite local and national stores around you. A lot of us get those flyers or circulars delivered to our home, but not all of us do. And it's often difficult to flip through and try to figure out, am I getting the best deal for something? Could I be getting a better deal somewhere else? And Flip does all of that legwork for you. And then when you're scrolling through the app, so you can scroll by store, so you can tap on like your favorite, I don't know, big box retailers, or you can type in the search window what you're looking for, and it'll pull up all the local deals for you. Yeah, so there's a fantastic feature within Flip that allows you to search for anything you want. So whether it's a TV or a grocery item or a store, you simply type in what you're looking for and it'll populate with all of the deals that are around you. And from there, you can filter from price, the store that you're looking to shop at. There's a lot of different options for you. And let's talk about the shopping list for a moment. So when you're scrolling and browsing through all the different uh, flyers or circulars near you, you can tap and hold to learn more about a product that you're interested in, or you can quickly tap and it it gets virtually clipped into your shopping list. But my favorite feature of the shopping list is that you can type in a keyword, like you said, televisions, for example, like you said earlier, and it'll actually show you all your local places that have the best deals on TVs. That's a pretty cool feature. And that's called a smart shopping list. Absolutely. So the smart shopping list takes your shopping planning to a whole nother level. You don't have to go looking for those deals by just typing in what you're looking for. It finds it for you. Okay, very cool. Love it. What are some things about Flip that people might not know? Because I know you have millions and millions of users, but maybe they're not using all of the features that Flip offers. I think you've highlighted a lot of really great features already, but we also have really fantastic features that come out during shopping seasons. So for Black Friday, for example, you'll be able to find a Black Friday carousel on the main page of the app, as well as a Black Friday tab. This is going to be pulling in all of those great deals and flyers for Black Friday, so you don't have to go looking for them yourself. So you've got this dedicated Black Friday carousel, and you can just strictly look for cool deals that are on uh, the 29th of November or leading up to it. So you can segregate by holiday or by season. Absolutely. During Black Friday and back to school, for example, you can find those dedicated tabs that pull in all of those deals for you. All right, Christina, as we wrap up the call to action, it's simply flip.com, right? F-L-I-P-P.com or to download the app from your favorite app store. Is that right? Absolutely. Free download from the Apple App Store or from Google Play. And again, it works just as well in the U.S. as it does in Canada and vice versa. So definitely check it out. Christina McNally, Flip's Chief Deals Officer. Thank you so much for your time and happy holidays to you. Thank you for having me. 
Well, that just about wraps up another Tech It Out show. Thank you very much for tuning in to episode 123, episode 123. And thank you again to Asus, the company that creates technology for today and tomorrow's smart life. For those in search of incredible, visit asus.com slash US slash radio for more info. Have a great rest of your weekend, everyone. Catch up with you next weekend, Thanksgiving long weekend on Tech It Out. Bye-bye for now. Thank you.